Star Wars night at fifth third field. Mudhens hosting Nashville. Top of the third, no score, and I've got a bad feeling about this. Corey Ray ropes one down the right field line, kicks around the corner long enough for Mario Feliciano to score from first. Nashville with the early lead. Mudhens Marcus Solbach making his first start for Toledo at home. Solid outing. Strikes out David Dahl. Six innings, four Ks, no walks, just the one run. Hens struggling offensively. Seventh man on for Jamie Westbrook. Right into the ship. Andres Monasterio at second. Sounds turn two. Eighth inning, still a one nothing game. Nashville two on for Abraham Almonte. And that's gone. A three-run homer. His fifth of the year makes it a 4 nothing lead. Mudhens having to try to use the force to get back into this one. Bomb the eighth, two on. Cody Clemens has been in a bit of a slump of late. Goes down swinging Toledo. Shutout at home. Final score, 5-0. Series wraps up tomorrow night with more from downtown. Welcoming the very busy Brad Wozniki alongside the Hall of Famer Jim Weber. Back out here one final time at Fifth Third Field. And tonight did not belong to the Mudhens. As Nashville and the Mudhens for seven innings of this game, it could have gone either way until that three-run homer from Abraham Almonte put it away. Yeah, at least we kept it close one nothing for the longest time. But when you look back on the game, Brad, the Mudhens had only four hits and twice had two men on base. And that was it. They never really came close to scoring. But you're going to have days like, uh, like they had today. Let's hope for the best uh, series finale tomorrow at 6.05. And one positive you can take out of tonight for the Mudhens, the starting pitcher, Marcus Solbach. He came in six innings, four strikeouts, did not allow a walk. And this was one of the longer outings we've seen from a Mudhun starter over the last three games. Yeah, and it's too bad he gave up one run and had to take a loss because we never scored. So he's the loser, unfortunately, giving up one run. Yeah, the big thing right now will be tomorrow. The Mudhens, can they take this series? They did the job the last three days, getting three straight wins. Now trying to take four out of six from the top team in the International League West and the International League, period. Yep, and so we're looking forward to that before the team heads out. Of course, we'll have uh, the Columbus game on Monday. There's no game on Tuesday. Five more down there before the Mudhens come back. The holiday weekend continues tomorrow. We'll see if the Mudhens can take the series.